So this tree, locally, people call it Guarumbo. There's many varieties. They have this uh, multiple leaf formations. And some of them make a fruit. So here's the fruit. So these finger type things are still hard. So I got lucky in this one because usually they go up pretty high, straight up. And this variety looks like it's edible, though the locals are convinced it is not. So I'm not sure who to believe. This one might be a bit old now. Should have came here yesterday or the, the day before. So I'll taste it. Those tiny little seeds and uh, yeah, let's see first. I'll smell. There's the Gordumba behind me. Hope I don't die. So it tastes well actually smells first, so I'm smelling it and it does smell a bit old now. Let's see. Mm, it's still kind of sweet. Yeah, it's not bad. It has a lot of tiny little seeds. Tastes a bit watery. Well, this will be a good test because I actually didn't have anything this morning yet, so any food or drink or anything. So if it is poison or toxic as the locals say, I will know about it instantly. <laughs> so far it's okay. It doesn't taste fermented or anything. Usually the riper the fruit the better, so in this case it's a little bit past. I think it was a bit sweeter a few days ago. But I'm not going to finish because I don't want to have too much with the new fruit. Here's how they look when they're ripe. So they seem to have some middle stem and the outer fruit parts jelly that surrounds the... Um, Seeds. And uh, they always tend to attract a lot of ants. When I cut them down, they always have lots of ants in the middle. In the middle, they're hollow, the trunk, so they do tend to fall over. And there's another fruit tree here, and these are wild as well wild apple, they call them. They smell so much like a green apple. And uh, the flowers are great looking and smelling. Just amazing. So yeah, maybe maybe this part of the farm I'll just let be a bit wilder. For now anyway. Up there behind in the distance, not too far, planted a black sapote, so there's lots of space and then uh mangosteen down there with the shade cloth. They can get 12 meter height, but right now they're, yeah, it's just less than a meter still, so nothing to worry about, and it's been a few years now, so here's another part. It's juicy, leaking, leaking juice. It didn't really rain much, so I don't know. Okay. So I guess that should document it enough, an edible version of Guarumbo. Let me know what you think. Ah, here I found another uh, less overripe, I would say. Maybe this is in the kind of perfect stage. Taste it. So here I'm going to try the less overripe one. Mm-hmm. Yeah, this is much sweeter than the other one. Yeah, it's sweet. I wanted to eat it all. Let's see if there's more even. The downside is if they propagate, they grow really quickly. But maybe that's a good thing. Maybe we'll just keep them short. And eat these delicious uh, guarumbos. I need to teach the locals about it because they 
seem to be convinced it's it's not edible. I'll come to them in the and I'm like, what the hell? <laughs> this one's got a bit of sour notes. Maybe it's slightly less ripe. Well, I guess that's probably it for this. Ah, here's one with a bunch of them, but I think they're not matured enough and they got kind of rotten a bit. So I just fertilize them. Here's the one that I think it got a bit overripe. It's probably a way to pick them even if they get um, tall. Because I think there's a stem here that holds a bunch of fingers. So there are the fingers that are not ripe yet. This one's gonna come ripe soon. This one looks like they're just fallen, maybe. So they're... Okay, I'll keep an eye on this. Looks like a good food source, if it is indeed good. And I will know about this, hopefully, by the end of today. I've already tried some, and I had no mal effects at all. So... Yeah, it's interesting. When I identify this variety. And, I mean, it's, yeah, the seeds are so small and they probably just propagate on their own easily. The taste is good, didn't have any fertilizer at all. So it must have decent mineral pulling qualities. There's more fruits up there. Very interesting. <laughs>